The sun's coming up after a few days, and Douglas is now fully grown. All the monsters are trying to get in here. I got this, like, moat around here to keep him from fighting them, because he almost died fighting a bear. But he is a full-grown forest dragon. I'm going to tame him with some fish. Not really sure how many it needs, but once I can actually click on him with this here bone... There we go. I think you just do one. And now he'll listen to me, and I can put a saddle on him. There we go, and I got my dragon. So here we go. Off to adventure! <laughs> yes! Douglas, let's go! This is so awesome. Hey guys, it's Adam AK Swimming Bird, and I'm joined by my good buddy, the Heart Ben. And we're going on an adventure. You ready, buddy? Yeah, boy. We're going to fly our dragons over the desert, and hopefully we're going to find a dungeon, because we need that AXP. We need those name tags. What? What is this? <laughs> this raccoon. My little buddy Swimming Bird. He's rubbing on your dragon. <laughs> They're friends. Aw, why did you name a raccoon? I guess raccoons are cool. It's all right. All right. You ready? I'm mounted up, buddy. Let's oh, do it. I'm mounted. So you guys were saying you wanted to see a more, you know, less edited adventure. Just kind of us straight adventuring, going out, having fun, riding our new dragon. So that's what we're going to do. And we need to find we need to find those telltale things in the desert, in the sand, that says there's a dungeon under here. Because we need a spawner. Like I mentioned, we need an EXP so we can get... Luck of the Sea, that's the enchantment we want on our fishing rod, and then we can get those name tags and start catching animals and stuff. Look at the shadow. This is, like, so cool, seeing the shadow of these dragons fly around. Ah. It is cool, Adam. It is very cool. I'm glad we got these. So is your... I heard a rumor that the Aether Dragon or Aether Dragon is faster. Should we line up next to each other and then do a race thing? Am I next to you? Yep. Gotta get right next to you. Okay, and turn around. Ready... Three, two, one, go towards those elephants. Go! Are you faster? I can't tell. Doesn't seem like it. I don't know. You might be. Uh, yeah. It's it's tough because this mod, the it's a really awesome mod, Dragon Mounts, but the creator hasn't like told us a lot of what is in it. Like <laughs> I don't know all the specifics of like like some of them are obvious. Like obviously, whoa! I fell off. <laughs> Obviously, the fire dragon is immune to fire, stuff like that. But I have no idea what my forest dragon actually does. <laughs> he just looks cool. That's all I, I know. I had a heck of a time trying to hatch my egg because uh, I couldn't figure out where I was supposed to do it. If you're watching this on mine and you haven't seen Ben hatch his aether dragon, check that out. Because Ben's uh, Ben had a little bit of an ordeal there, but I, as you can see, he got his sweet made dragon. It through. We both hatched them separately. That's kind of the plan with this, is like, whenever we want to do solo episodes, we can do that. Whenever we want to do group adventures like this, then we can do it. Should we I split up, or should we... Somehow. I don't know. I guess I we... lost your giant green dragon. Okay, I think <laughs> I see you. If we can split up if you want, but yeah, it's like we can cover more ground here. Try to load in all this crazy desert. I think we explored some of this just to get temples Are you on stuff. your dragon? I am on my dragon. I can't see it. It's just you floating in the air. <laughs> it might be, like, that. that's the same thing that happens with some mods like Pixelmon and stuff, where you'll see, like, the person running through the air, or... Like, I saw you riding your dragon perfectly fine, but... Sometimes I did it, see you on your dragon, but now I don't. Maybe it's because you're standing... Oh, now you're gone. It might be because I'm loading chunks in. I want to make oh, sure... Oh, you weren't even my... standing where I was looking. You're probably flying way yeah. off Yeah. Oh my! Because it looked like you were just floating in the middle of the air. This <laughs> is... Yeah, like, that does happen. It's probably that? the same thing as Pixelmon. Maybe when we get that mod API and things are a little less glitchy oh, with ride oh, stuff. You there you are. I see you flying through the air. Hey, here's your dragon. <laughs> oh, that, <laughs> how, you caught up to it. Okay. I, yeah, you caught up to yours. Because I saw your dragon go by, and then you were just kind of like standing in the sky looking around. Like, you didn't even know what was going on. I think it's I when, when you pop into view. then you. Can I was baffled. Do it, yeah. You didn't know what was going on. Purely baffled. This is a pretty big desert we got here. I gotta <laughs> try... Oh, there we go! Ah, I was about to say, I gotta try not to hit shift to land, but look, there's a desert, a uh, dungeon nice. here, and then it's got an ostrich in it, which is good. Let's so, cross our fingers for a skeleton dungeon. Yeah, that's what I want to get arrows. Ben figured out a sweet trick that if you jump on your dragon uh, on zombie. zombie... That's still good, though. It's not far from base, I don't think. Um, but Ooh. the trick that you found out is if you jump on the dragon when he's been boned and he's just sitting on the ground, he'll stay sitting when you land again, which is cool. Ah, two dragon eggs. I got two dragon eggs, too. What? We gotta get... You have so many dragon eggs. You have, like, eight. I need to catch up with you. Seven, eight, nine. Now I have nine, so I would have had ten. 
We need enough so that we can fill the zoo, obviously, but... Right. Yeah. I'm not, I don't actually have ten or, like, nine dragon eggs of my own. We have three yeah, dragon together. eggs together. Everything is together. Zoo the zoo, my brother. We are in it together. This is a sweet ostrich. Zoo the zoo. He's going to live here and watch over this, I guess. I'm going to screenshot these cords so I can peep this later. I should do that, too. Okay. Well, we can keep but. looking because I would like to find a... Skeleton one, if we can. We actually... I can already call this a successful. Uh, yeah, that was quick. I'm surprised we found it so quick. And we can get our free dragons iron. are just like magnets to each other. They man. love. I loved how in Ben's episode. I don't want to spoil it if you haven't watched it yet. But Ben's dragon has a liking for Douglas. <laughs> oh, did you? You named your dragon, right? I named it in my head, not with a name tag. Yeah, me too. We haven't, we don't have any name tags yet. That's why we need to get those fishing rods enchanted. So if I remember to do this later and you see this comment pop up, someone suggested I name my dragon Bemo because it vaguely resembles Bemo in color, and I think it's a cool uh, crossover between has, all the other videos we do. So Yeah, it has glowy eyes a little bit. Almost looks like he's some type of crazy dragon technology. Or she, we don't know. She, yeah, we don't know. Just like Bemo. <laughs> That's always a controversy. People are like, is Bimo a guy or a girl? It's, it's a robot, though. Anyways, oh, I found a village. I think we've been here maybe already. Let's oh, I'm sure. Well, I don't know. Maybe not because I didn't take any of the carrots or anything. I was yeah. on a big carrot stealing rampage. There's no blacksmith, And there's still though. plenty of uh, villagers here, so. We could use the books. Because <laughs> we need to. I've been enchaining. I forgot to do that before we left, but I've been enchaining a ton of books to try to get that luck of the sea. And no luck so far. Ironically, I'm going to keep my eyes open around here. I'll try not to fly too far, but I'm going to kind of peruse this area. Really want that skeleton dungeon because the arrows would be so, so helpful. I've been using a ton of my arrows to kill ogres. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I did it's not. It's hard not to just like fluke, <laughs> like not fluke. I'm playing too much card wars. Yeah. I'll flip and jump right off because I, I did that too and I just started flying around. Oh no. I found the temple I wanted, I probably already I it. wanted to uh, go down and of course I tried to push shift. Oh, all right. And we're back and our dragons are kissing in the background. So I lost some of my stuff, but I did get some of it back. Man, that was scary. I thought I lost Douglas here, but Ben was smart and he was like, I bet it teleported to you when you were at your bed and he did. So I got him and we got back. I got good equipment. Let's go. Hopefully I will not push shift again and fall off of my dragon. <laughs> How many hearts does your dragon have? I think you have 62. Right? Yeah, okay. I can't count. Because it shows it in the like horse hearts <laughs> down there, which is kind of funny. Like three rows. Yeah, and it says 60 in the, uh, the whatchamacallit. Oh, yeah. So that's like 60 half hearts. Anyways. You were going to talk about something before I fell off like an idiot. <laughs> you know what, Adam? That's true. I was going to talk about something, but now that you fell off your dragon, I'm not going to. What? JK, <gasps> I was going to say, look at how smooth these dragons ride compared to the horses in Minecraft. Like, these are, like, buttery smooth compared to the horses. Buttery right? smooth. Yeah, the, uh... I mean, like, we fly fast enough to where the chunks haven't loaded all the way, but in the horses, I feel like they just are super sketchy, and these are pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, I, uh... The, so kudos I've, to the mod maker. If you're the mod maker, good one. I've been following this mod for a while. The Barracuda ATA is the guy that made it. But there was a period there where his... The flying was really jittery, but he fixed it again. So now it's nice and smooth. I rebound some of my buttons, so hopefully I can fly a little easier. Rebound. rebound. I know some of you guys are probably saying, Ooh, there was a pyramid down there! But I can promise you that I've looted and kabooted yeah, it, so we no hit. Worries most of this like we were going through this desert getting most of the villages and stuff look at those dragon shadows um but we didn't actually i didn't think to like pay attention to the ground and look for dungeons so that's what we're doing now and we found one so that's that's fairly close we could make a little grinder there and get good xp <clears throat> but if we find a skeleton one that's perfect for me because uh i love those arrows stuff like the ogres and things are so tough to fight that uh i like using arrows on them one of the ogres almost killed me and my dragon when That's I was true. Uh, just hanging out. He just burst through my dragon's nest. <laughs> I just sat there and watched it all happen. Did you? I don't know. No, if you I were... wasn't on the server. <laughs> okay, I was like, were you hatching your egg and you just watched it? Because you were, were around. Watching me die. I think you were hatching at the time. Because <laughs> we oh, were that's possible. filming at the same time for parts of it. But yeah. All right. I still got to figure out what other dragons I'm going to hatch. I got two more eggs, so I've got 
four more I can hatch. You got like enough to do all eight dragons, I think. I sure do. There's a magical flower forest. That's romantic. Maybe our dragons should go smoosh in there. Hmm. This desert is huge. This isn't large biomes. What's going on? This is just a cool giant desert. Sunflower plains. Don't mind if I do. The, s the moon's coming up. So now you guys can kind of see the brighter shaders that we went in and edited. So you guys can see much nicer here. Even though we don't lay any lights down, you should be able to see quite a, get a bit more at night. It was like pitch black before. It was crazy. There's a zombie on a bat horse. We should go fight him. I'm going to drop down. I'm going to get off. And I'm going to have my dragon fight with me. Go, dragon. There he goes. Oh, heart of darkness. That doesn't sound like a real thing, but it is. It's not just a. It's not just a <laughs> oh, book. Oh yeah, kapow! Heart of darkness. <laughs> heart of darkness. So the the hearts that the horses drop, I have. Oh, two of them. I have a heart of the undead as well, and they're used to make little potion things. And we can get our own bat horse or our own magical unicorn or fairy horse. There's all these crazy horses you can make, but they are also used to make the staff to go to the withern dimension. Ah, oh, should we fight these golems, Ben? Um, yeah, Adam. We could get some diamond and some emerald. I'm going to take a quick screenshot because we might die. Oh, oh I almost jumped off my, ho my dragon, but I managed to click him again. <laughs> that was awesome. All right, let's drop down here. Come on, dragon. Let's go, Douglas. We're going to go into battle. How, how you feel about this, dragons? I think with our dragons, we could probably do a lot more damage. I, I don't have to have him unsit. Oh, yeah. Ooh, that's good. That's a good idea. I'm going to go unsit him. What the heck? Because I forgot This thing to. isn't even getting hit. Oh, is the golem coming up? Oh, whoa, what's going on? There's zombies everywhere. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Help me. Help me. Not you. I meant Douglas. Douglas, hit these guys. Yeah, he's doing it. It's awesome. There are so many zombies. Oh no, the golem is, is becoming full. I'm fighting zombies on the hill. I need to get down there and help you in this sec here. Creeper. Uh-oh. Yeah, he's gonna... Whoa, I just fell into a big old sand hole. What's, What's happening? happening I'm getting things. hurt. I'm getting hurt. Oh my gosh. Oh, the big yeah. golem killed me. Are you alive? Yep. Okay, I'm gonna try to fly back to you. I fell in a hole and then the big golem like hurt ah, me. No. Ah, oh no. Nigga. Oh no. Oh no. I'm flying back, Ben. I'm coming. Go, Douglas. Fly. I'm, I'm flying away. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I have hardly like my dragon is also that, that was a poor decision yeah in, our uh, band, in retrospect ah make... oh, what the, the heck? those golems are really tough okay i wasn't even by it all right we're alive again <laughs> we're safe we died not that far from base but we learned a valuable lesson about taking on two golems <laughs> at once and everything's all right man that was quite an adventure we found a zombie spawner so i'm happy that that was our goal to find a spawner and we can start getting those name tags and getting our zoo animals. Also, we have awesome dragons. That's the best part. <laughs> that's true, that's true. Look at this land, Ben. This plains. This will one day be our glorious zoo. I'm excited. Hope you are too. Alright, thanks for watching, guys. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this. Maybe subscribe. If you're watching on mine, subscribe to Heart Ben. Watch his. His videos are different. He's hatching different dragons and stuff. We're going to try to do like a different experience in each of ours. So you can see both. If you watch, and if you're watching Heartbends, I've been talking a lot, despite it being his video. <laughs> Alright, thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you next time. Zoo the zoo, my friends! Zoo the zoo.